Okay. All right, so I'm here with James Robin Hood Cleveland. We're gonna walk and talk because we're headed to breakfast after a trip to the New Hampshire Supreme Court, this building. Inside, we just heard five justices listen to oral arguments by the city of Keene and it's on the civil rights attorney, John Meyer. How do you think it went? I think it went pretty well. It's hard to know what's gonna happen. It's funny, uh, one of the points they brought up with um, to John was like, oh, what if someone's falling you 12 inches? Well, number one, that didn't happen. And then also, uh, there's no allegations that we ever followed them while off duty. So, I can understand that they're upset. My goal is just to fill the parking meters and prevent tickets. And one of the things, I'm insulted the city didn't even bother to come try to talk to any of us when they filed this lawsuit. Like, to me, that was very insulting. That's not neighborly. That's not a nice thing to do. If you have a problem with someone, let them know. You know what I mean? So they should have uh, sought recourse outside of the court system before they just filed a lawsuit against us. Um, another thing that I found fascinating, they made this deal about they wait outside the bathroom. That makes it sound like we were right outside the bathroom, which is ridiculous. You know, that really didn't happen. They're going on break. We're waiting outside because I only want to fill parking meters that would have been ticketed. It's not my intention to go around and just fill parking meters. That's not what Robin Hooding is, in my opinion. Uh, I only want to fill the ones that would have been ticketed. So I don't know. It's it's interesting. I feel that it's kind of ridiculous it's gone this far, but I'm pleased that hopefully we'll better set a precedent that yes, you can hold government officials accountable, and yes, you can tell them how you feel. So.